Congratulations. Um, performance, is it, it's astonishing. You don't really hold anything back at all in it. Were you... Is that a good thing? <laughs> yes. But I was wondering whether you were at all fearful. It's so open, so honest. Whether you were at all worried about... about doing well, it. Well, I mean, Jasmine is somebody who is experiencing... She's greatly deluded and exists in a fantasy world rather than reality, but yet also in some deep recess of her being knows how the world really works. So she's deeply conflicted, and also she's somebody who's, uh, from the minute the film opens, she's already talking about her nervous breakdowns and her Xanax addiction. So there's a lot going on, and so if you don't throw yourself at it, then you're kind of missing out on an amazing opportunity. And look, you know, you just hope that it works. What's it down a Woody Allen set like? It's very workmanlike. It's very fast, and it's like making a student film. You know, he, he makes he makes the films for two pound ninety nine, and and that that enshrines his creative freedom. So there's none of that, bi- you know, those big trailers and and all of those trappings that people associate with with filmmaking. And so it's very it's 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 a bit like making an Australian film. Actually, it's quite non hierarchical and it moves very quickly. Can I ask, um, with regards to you as a performer, to be able to explore a character not only physically but their psyche as well, was that exciting for you? It's look, it's great. I mean, I've been working primarily in the theatre for the last six years, and you know, having played characters like Blanche Dubois on, on, on stage, you, you, that kind of it, it lives inside you somewhere, and um, and I'm sure that informed in some way the playing of this role. But I mean, it's if a character's life is functioning entirely there's not a lot of drama and there's an inherently um, dramatic situation with Jasmine because she's falling apart. The interesting thing as well is that her backstory is strongly integrated into the screenplay so with regards to your preparation was that was that a great help? Well we shot all of the San Francisco stuff the, the present day first and then we did the New York stuff afterwards and at the time I sort of would have wanted it to be flipped the other way but that's just how it was you never make things in sequence in film but it was um so yeah, we got straight into the the heart of it, and we actually filmed the end sequences first, which is always very um, weird. So I really just had to throw myself at it. Thank you very much.